Okay. I am so disappointed. So I just got this haul uh, that Jabo, um, he led me to this this uh, auction that was going on, and this was not a, a eBay auction. This was another site, and he he contacted me and said, "Hey, have you seen this? Uh, I've never seen these the stuff that's up for auction. Um, I don't want to bid against you if you're bidding on it already." I said, no, I hadn't seen it, so I checked it out. I said, oh, man, yeah, I really want to get that stuff. And, uh, he, you know, he bowed out. Uh, I did win the auction, and this is the haul video for that. But I've been so in a hurry and excited to get this stuff open and, and see it that I forgot to turn on the main camera. So I have footage from the GoPro, uh, and then towards the second half of it I have footage of the uh, um, from the main camera so I have footage from the GoPro and, and the on the Canon camera over but uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and edit this I haven't edited all of it I don't know how much of it I'm gonna be able to use uh, I don't even know how much of this I'm gonna be able to use because I've got my camera turned around so I can stay in the 4k uh, but here we go let's see what we got hopefully it's not a whole bunch of pictures of big brown box all right Welcome to Brick Trains, and I'm Joey, and I got a haul today that I am really excited about. So, a couple days ago, a week ago, more or so, uh, Brick Czar, fellow YouTuber, everybody should know him. If you don't, go to the channel, there's a card. Uh, he contacted me and said, hey, have you seen this auction? And uh, uh, I'm not going to tell the specifics where it was at or everything, I don't know. I'm not, he mentions it every once in a while, but at any rate... Uh, I said, no, I hadn't seen it, so, uh, he said, well, you, you know, check it out or whatever, and I, uh, he said, I don't want to bid against you, and he said, I, I've just not ever seen what was up for auction, and, uh, I said, okay, so I checked it out, and I communicated with him, yeah, you're right, strange and unusual, right up my alley, something I hadn't seen, uh, and I was pretty excited to bid on it, I won the auction, and, uh, so here it is. So it's had the special delivery for evenings. Uh, wasn't going to be home, and neither was the wife. So let's see if we can get this cut open. And since it came FedEx, nothing against FedEx, but since it came FedEx, I don't trust FedEx. I've had, well, I've had special issues. At any rate, okay, so here we go. We got bubble wrap. Now, everybody's gonna say, well, it's just parts boxes, really. And I'm gonna say, yes, it is. And first off, I'm gonna say, man, we did a heck of a job wrapping these. We did a heck of a job wrapping these. It's gonna be probably terrible on the microphone. Now, all these boxes, I essentially bought all the boxes sight unseen. That's not true. I saw them, but they had them all stacked up like this. And all stacked up like this, so they never showed, never showed what was in them. And right now I can tell you all already, three of the boxes, out of the first three, Two of them I don't have. At least one. Uh, one's a different color variant than I got. I got the parts. So we'll look at those all here in a second. I just want to get them out and get the box out of the way. And I already see the the reason that I was in this auction. Get it out in a minute. Alright, these. <clears throat> Common plates, but they're good. Good parts. Again, I said I'll, I'll go over these loops in a second. Let me get them all out of here. Also, no duplicates so far. It's unusual. This is probably somebody's collection. Uh, windows. So there's going to be 17 of these boxes. Right. Here's something funny. I got to look in the other day. And, you know, 
Brick Czar had the whole super rare 2x4 red brick. I got to look through my parts. These parts boxes like this and you know these are kind of my thing. I, I really like these parts boxes and I got to noticing these 218s alright which is a 2x4 brick they came in multiple colors. There's a blue one. Here's a white one. All right. <laughs> I've never seen a two by four red brick in the package. Or a red one in the package in these parts box. I'm not saying they didn't exist. They definitely existed. They were definitely made. But the red brick was the most common, and I ain't I've never seen one. I ain't. I'm like, kind of excited. Two twenty-twos and two twenty-one, so those are one by ones and one by two. Last bundle. And unless there's one in here, again because I, I didn't see which parts were in these, I kind of hoping to get the number two eighteen or the two by four red brick. I got two, so far we got a white and a blue. But no red. We did get a 520 green. That's I say unusual, but actually 520 green is not, it's not that rare in these part boxes. Okay. So there are all the parts boxes, which leaves us to the main event. Get rid of the box. Spread this stuff around here so we can see both cameras. I'm good. I got my got my handy dandy trusty cell phone so I can actually see what is on the GoPro. Because this one I did not want to mess up. I always kind of go back and redo some of these with these haul videos, especially this one. I did not want it messed up. I didn't want to. Once it was open, it was open. Alright, what do we got? What do we got? Being a little more careful with these. Uh, yeah, they even put them in the Lillian Bubble Wrap, but they put them in... Uh-oh, I think there was a bonus item in here. Got them in a bag. That's cool. Tape. I'm getting ready to not be gentle. Don't need the bag. Okay, let's look at this bonus item. That is missing a part. Some tape. At any rate, that's that is a train, and boy has it been warped. <laughs> that is not what we're in here. In fact, I don't even remember seeing that in the auction. Here, uh-oh, blue part it goes with that one. Am I killing you yet? Trust me, I'm killing myself. <laughs> this is what I've been looking for. This is a salesman sample, essentially. Like in a toys... Uh, uh, like if they went to the toy fair or whatever. This would have been a sample that... Um, Samsonite would have been given out. So, a new concept in education and play. See for yourself how easily these Lego bricks snap together and stay with a precision fit, yet they come apart with a simple twist and the child is ready to build again. Huh. Snap together and twist apart. There's the back side. I'm getting that. No glare. So, what we got was uh, one rare 2x4 brick, red, and one white. 2x4 brick. Maybe not so rare. Uh, it says the Lego system is another media that should give that extra something to children to help them to be creative. They are suitable for many age levels. That's good. Until you're 99, right? You can't play with Lego after you're 99. Uh, many age levels. They are safe. They are durable. They lend themselves to the development of social play, dramatic play, creative play, 
manipulative and constructive play. So this was an association with uh, Play Schools Association Incorporated. Play Schools Association Incorporated. Hmm, that's interesting. I have to figure out who that was. Okay, so we got one, two. This one's got a staple in it, so they were either stapled together or to something else. That would be interesting. I wonder. Would love to just see a couple of them stapled together here. Kind of makes me think. Since there's like a staple in about every other one. We're up to four there now. <clears throat> that it might have been these were stapled to something else. Some other. I lost count. Three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. So, and a little wad of yellow tape. I mean, I like vintage stuff, but vintage yellow tape is not up my alley here. Okay, so let's go through. <laughs> I got the exciting part. I want to go do some research. Let's see, was there any no uh, no numbers? It does give the educational division Lego system by Samsonite, um, Denver, Colorado. So that's in fact. Looky here. It just I just seen it. It's this train. So. I will have, I now, <laughs> I am compelled. Um, it's missing, and it was glued. I see it. Oh, oh man, this is coming together. This, oh, wow, this is scary. I don't know if we're going to be able to see that, but right there is a tiny little bit of glue. So I'm going to guess, yep. I hate pulling on this because I don't want to pull it apart, especially now. So, speculating here, I would say that because that spot right there would be the smokestack. This is a sand dome. Um, oh, look out. Trains kind of sneaking out of my head there. So I'm guessing, and oh, I can see it there too. There would have been a smokestack there, and the rest of the train, or the rest of the, the tender, you know, it's missing a piece there one by one and then one by two and there's a glue mark there and if we flip it over I can't see anything um, but I'm going to guess that there would have been two more red bricks and this would have matched so this is going to become part of this um, I will also build this Lego man and uh, um, in fact let's stop this for a second and I'll go I'm gonna go fix this up and I'm gonna fix that Lego man up I'll be right back okay so I'm back and I lost my GoPro at least I lost the phone here so I'm gonna hold it up here's the train completed got uh, Smoke stack on there, and we got the rest of the coal bunker, coal car tender, or whatever you want to call it, on there. And then, and this guy here, whoo, got him built. Hopefully, I'm getting him in the shot. Back him up a little more. Try and pick him up. So, I used as many cellulose acetate bricks as I could find. Uh, so it's, it's probably 90% cellulose, ac cellulose acetate bricks. Um, you can tell them because they're a little bit lighter color. Let's see if I can go inside. There's a ABS there, cellulose acetate. ABS would have been available back then. Um, it just, cellulose acetate was, it looks like all these bricks are cellulose acetate. So this is what is pictured on the front. These two models. This model is glued together. 
So I'm thinking that this is some kind of, this whole thing probably was some kind of salesman display maybe. Uh, maybe it was, maybe they went into the school systems and uh, tried to sell schools on it. I, I don't know. I, I got to do some research. I got to see if I can find out what, what these are for, what this was stapled to. Uh, I did say I was going to go through these real quick, so I'm going to take care of that really quick. We got some, let's move this stuff around just a little bit because I don't know how close I'm getting to the camera. Uh, 224 red macaronis and 280 slash 3. That's blue roof pieces. I probably have the macaroni. The blue roof pieces, I don't think I have. So let's put that on the don't have pile. 219 gray, two by threes, uh, 519 white uh, plates. I didn't open these up. Yeah, but whoever had these, they've got them all mixed. There's white and black. So I'm gonna have to open up every one of these and sort the colors back out. Uh, honestly, I don't know on these. Green 520, I know I have that one. Red 222, one by one bricks, I got that. Uh, black, one by one, 222. Um, may not have that one. And we'll stick that over to the may not have pile. 221, so those are uh, black one by twos. Pretty sure I don't have those, at least in that color. All right, here's another 519. Put that here. And a 219, that's a white 2x3. More than likely have that one for sure. 521-2. So 1x2 and 1 plates in white. I know I don't have that one. 218. <clears throat> this is the interesting one. It's not interesting. It's kind of an oddball to me. 218 is 2x4 bricks. Now this is for a white box of bricks. I can, I can see inside there there's yellow 2x3s, so that's it's probably filled with who knows what. All these are probably filled with who knows what. I don't have one of these, uh, and I don't have a red one. Uh, two nine, or shoot, 214.9, those are the little 1x1, one one, the old style windows. I don't believe I had that one. I really don't believe I had it in white. And just very few of those I have in white. Uh, 222. That's blue one by ones. I don't think I have that one. Here's another do I have 518. No. 518 in white. That's two by four plates. Um, and I say white, not gray. This is going to be. Let's see. Let's find the right one. Can you see the difference? I don't know if that's going to show up on camera or not. The top one's gray, the bottom one's white. And then to make it all worse, there was clear. And they kind of sank. So here's another 218, which is the 2x4 bricks in blue. I know I don't know that one. And then a 214.8, the 1x2 window. So that's everything I got in the hall. Pretty much everything on this side. Pretty much all these I don't have. These I got to kind of question. They may be new color variants or I have duplicates already. And lo and behold, I see no part and color duplicate. Co well, wait a minute. I do. There's the only two that I got the exact same in this haul. 519 white, one by two plates. No big deal. So I'm going to take one of these. And I'm going to put it in this purple envelope. I'm going to seal it, I'm going to weigh it, mail it, and that's coming to you, Brickstar. Thanks for watching. Okay, so that was a hot mess. Forgot to turn the camera on. Um, lost a mic battery on the wireless. Um, disconnected from the GoPro from the phone, so I couldn't see the GoPro. That's what I get for trying to be in a hurry. Try to get this one shot before I go to work. Uh, try to get it edited. Try to get it uploaded. So if you're seeing this, it got uploaded. Well, it's going to get uploaded. Hopefully you're seeing this this morning. Uh, 
at the same time it was released, I was doing this. Any rate, uh, Jabo, thanks for the tip. Appreciate it. I really, really do. A uh, little small token of my appreciation is in the mail. I will drop that off on my way to work. Everybody, thanks for watching. No comment contest.